Today we're going to be taking a look at the CATS Heaters Oil and Coolant Immersion Heater. Now this is going to be a really great solution for those winter months when it's harder for your engine to start. A lot of times what happens is that fluids in our engine or our coolant tank tend to thicken up as it gets colder outside and that can cause a lot of damage to the engine since there's just not as much lubrication happening with those fluids. So this is going to prevent that by keeping that fluid warm throughout the night and then whenever you're ready to start your vehicle you just remove it and start your engine like normal and it should start up a lot faster, smoother and easier and that's going to help the engine to heat up faster and warm up your car faster as well. It's going to make your vehicle more reliable and also to prevent any damage that can happen whenever those fluids get bound up. It also helps to reduce condensation in your engine block, which is also going to help to emit less pollution and fewer gas emissions. Now this does come with the power cord. It just plugs in. As you can see, it has a two-prong design. We'll just match that up to the power cord and push that together until it connects and then thread on the included nut with that to keep everything snug and secure. Now one thing that's nice about this power cord being separate is that should this ever become damaged all we have to do is replace the cord instead of the entire unit and we can be on the road faster with that. The other end will just plug into a normal 120 volt AC outlet this can be routed out through your grill to get that plugged up. The heating element is constructed of durable rust proof stainless steel. It is CSA approved and it's made in the USA. Now as far as some dimensions for this, the thread size is going to be one inch by NTP standard and then the length on that heating element is going to be about three and three quarters of an inch long and that's going from the end of the heating element to where the threads start. The wattage on this is going to be 150 watts. Now a couple other notes to keep in mind with this. You don't want to use this heater with a 100% antifreeze solution and you definitely don't want to start your engine with the heater plugged in. You want to make sure that that's unplugged before you go to start your engine. And that's going to do it for our look at the CATS Heaters Oil and Coolant Immersion Heater.